All right, we are back again. Anyway, just coming the first anniversary of my YouTube channel, and so far this is just talking about like the community and how well we've been doing. And without further ado, let's go into the video. Oh God, I can't believe I'm doing this again. So yeah, we're just gonna cover what happens like in the Team V versus Team X game. So of course, again. Ario talks to them about like how oh, they didn't work together in the first game and even though they scored 9 goals, it was too easy. But anyway, it gets it off for Boru's team introduction and going straight to provoke Nachira. I mean, why would you even do that? Bro, you literally need to even be him. What do you think you're? What do you think you are, bro? Anyway, he says the inverse team beat that the most team wise, so he already knows he's gonna try and underest and it shouldn't be underestimated that easily. You can tell because of course Alpha Baru is the best striker. <laughs> But I digress. Anyway, anyway, anyway. So yeah, kickoff starts, and you already know that you're ready to win this game. Really, his ego is actually blew me a bit. But anyway, let's start off with the match. So Nachira passes to Nanetsu with ease, technically. Now Nanetsu wants to try and score by himself, but you forgot that. Like you're facing Alpha Baru, of course they're gonna stop you. And just mind you, this is where real destruction starts. Like from now. Because bro, is, you forgot you're facing the strongest character of all time, so don't judge him. If I think I don't even judge him at all, you forgot you're facing him, so don't even think of that trying this again. But I think he's, ah, you know that some people are stupid sometimes. Anyway, that was level of stupidity. He gets past the entirety of the Team V game, team, and yeah, they scored the first goal. And of course, you already know that's how it works. He shows off. Next is next, Nachira knows I have conceded their first goal entirely, and I let Aryo's chime, like how. Oh. Also, Aryo has not been covered so far, like recently in the second selection, so we still wonder, where is he? Like, where is he gonna go? These lots are still wondering. Anyway, but you know what happens next. Just when Aryo had the time to shine, Alfred steals the ball from him with ease. Then proceeds to flick. I oh, mind you. Once again, he proceeds to flick. Flick! Isn't this not your specialty? Just clarify, that is his specialty, but yeah, I digress. That's not. This man proceeds to destroy him first. Bro proceeds to start the flicking the generation. Anyway, my match is all a bit, but who really cares? Anyway, Team X and Team B, and now Nacho is starting to get pissed. Because now Alpha has two goals. Like, bro is actually the one who's gonna be stealing his record, but eventually they all get 16 16 goals in the first selection. So, but if you wanna know about the real, real thing, well, check out my YouTube channel. So, yeah, our Nacho gets past the entirety of the attacking team of um, Team X. Then, Ario gives him a Travella pass. Then, Nacho traps does a galactic trap. And make sure that the trap is built different. Because, for real, this trap is actually crazy, not gonna lie. It's literally crazy. This man does a galactic trap. This man, this man will still come out as one of the best traps. Almost like Nagi zone, but it's not Nagi's anyway, so. It's a combination of Nagi and Bachira, so. That one, it's already decided. But anyway, after the trap, he scores the first goal, and now the real, real, real threat begins. Because Alfred is ready to destroy this man. Alfred is ready to destroy all of Team X. Sorry, all of Team V. Because now, it's not just Aura, and yet, Alfred's monster Aura. But the thing is, he never revealed this, he's just showing the little inside of it. Why well, I think the teeth is a bit like, weird, and it didn't really show before, so, yeah. He had a glimpse of his monster Aura here. Normally, it should be blue, but here, in this case, all of them already designed their Auras. He already had Aura before Aura was, like, solidified. His Aura was not solidified yet, but it is now. Like, Technically is now, so yeah, that's how it works. So in three, two, one, we'll finally get to see the ultimate ability next happening, which is Alpha Baru's destruction. This man has all of his monster in his back. Destroys the two. Destroys the entire team on its own. So, gets past all of them. But you know what happens next is shocking. Like it's absolutely built broken. This man proceeds to destroy and destroy and destroy until he reaches Nachia. Like, until he reaches him, not 
not Josh tries to grab him, but then he gets destroyed so badly to the point where you can't even stop him. And then he proceeds to break this scale and show them what real destruction is. Yep, you can't stop Alpha Maru. This man already has a hat trick before Nacho. Crazy, not gonna lie, because Nacho got four goals the first game and this man already got a hat trick. So yeah, there's a problem, he's gonna catch up with you in ease. Anyway, anyway, anyway. I digress because anyway, they're still the top goal scorers. They will all ob obviously act like this. But now the moment we've been waiting for. So you think just come come around and destroy my team? I'll show you what real. <laughs> Mr. Honor has the beard. <laughs> now real destruction really, really, really begins. Because we'll finally get to see a glimpse of Nachira's true ego. The ego of all men ways to see. The ego that I have been saving for like this moment. This is why I actually created episode Nachira anyway. So we'll finally get to see the marked or the art that we've all been waiting to see in three, two, one. Yep, the first game gets past the entire team V, does the exact flick that Alpha Maru did to him, proceeds to literally dink it past the entire the goalkeeper. Wait, yep, this man is built different. Definition of why some people are just built different. Next, next, he just scores his third goal. He's of just he doesn't really care about the hat trick. He just does whatever he wants at this point. But we don't really really care about this one. Well, I care about the fourth goal because the fourth goal is the definition of why the hell did he even do this? Because Alpha Maru tries this, then he proceeds to do the exact same thing. Destroyer Rin did against Niu. Bro, he thought it was easy. Nigga, it's not that easy. Bro, Force was the fourth goal. Fourth. Bro, so we're passed off for Boru this game in goals. With ease. You mean to tell when this man scored past him in goals? Then, of course, Alpha Boru is already pissed to the point where he's already just delusional at this point. Because Bro thinks he's, they are now winning. My guy, you're losing 4 3. You're not gonna come back that easily. I mean, he is the strongest, but he's not that strong against Nacho. Because. Bro proceeds to try and beat Nanatsu, beat Aria, but he already knows that. Where is Alpha? Where is Nachia? Yeah, 3, 2, 1, he's gonna come out like this. He stole the ball from him with ease, and he passes it to Aria, where the final moments of the game are just hyped. We've been waiting for this moment, and now we're gonna see the best moment in the history of episode Nachia. The history of the entire first selection. We'll finally see how he recreated the, one, the best bicycle kick of all time. I mean, I did rank his goals, but I not rank the hype. I mean, so I had changing the rankings anyway. So yeah, they do a 1-2. Natural tries game past them. And just clarify, all the eye styles are the same, so that's how it works. And next moments are just crazy. Because... After he does the pass, Robert is to trap the ball, lick his tongue, and says the ultimate catchphrase, I'm a beer blower. You laugh for now. Bro puts it, he jumps, puts his hand on Alpha Ball's back, and while he's right, bro, doing my super kick, this moment happens on the one on ultimate hype. Three, two, one. Yeah. Yeah. Bro proceeds to do the exact no on no on bicycle kick on his back. Just to clarify, this is the best moment in the entire episode Nacho because this is how the goal was created. This man did the exact same thing episode Nacho and no on no one did. So you can all see how this lot was able to recreate it. Still, I think I may have to change my ranking again. I may seriously have to start changing my ranking. But yeah, out of the goal, this is how it ends. So yeah, Team V wins the game 5-3 with Nacho all scoring 5 goals and Alpha Mark scoring all 3. Bro already knows that you have one hell of an ego. Bro just proceeds the line like this and just said too easy. Yep, that is how the game ends. But anyway, this is my third video take so just ignore the weirdness of how this took so long anyway. But yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next one.